uh, pretty calm there for a little bit and got to the end of the second stage and it's like it's bananas out here um, wiped out a bunch of cars and and at the end it's obviously very intense uh, for the win you got a lot of do or die moments uh, for guys up front there so um, yeah I think everything we expected uh, hard to get track position hard to make moves um, once you get up there and if you can have your teammate with you like like Brad and uh, Chris did they're unbeatable how do you attack the final 10? Uh, I mean, the same as we, we've always done it. Um, yeah, you got to get through the first round. Uh, we got to survive long enough to make our cars faster. I think that's the biggest thing right now is our, our you know, we're, we're close. Um, but I think we need to find a way to survive to for the round of eight. And then from there, hopefully our cars are fast enough to win. And so we got six weeks to, to grind it out. And then hopefully we got something we can win with. Did you see there are the racks from your front window? Uh, well, I saw the big one uh, off of four there then the second stage, um, and I just saw Priest rolling in my mirror, uh, which looked like the most violent roll we've seen in a long, long, long time. Which I, he's okay, right? They, they told me he was okay. He is? There. All right, I don't know. I he hope he's okay. Times. He got out under his own Well, it was pretty though. violent looking, too, from the big screen there, so I rolled by it, so that's scary. It looked like it just caught wind and flipped over. Is that what it was? Just caught wind. Blaney took a cool. pretty violent shot, too. Blaney did? Is he okay? He's okay. Oh, okay. I didn't see his head. Yeah, yeah just short. Two, one. Oh, I just did. Oh, yeah. He hit him hard. Yeah. Cool. Is that just a testament? I mean, the fact that they walk away, a testament to the innovations that we've seen since 2001? Sure. Yeah, I, I guess so. Uh, hate has got to happen, though. I, I hate it happens. I, I can tell you one thing, they're walking away, but they're hurt. Uh, it don't feel good, <laughs> I can promise you that. I'm looking at the wreck right now. So but, uh, yeah, it's the reason why nobody really likes coming to these racetracks. <laughs> it's those, those moments. Moments said he still feels it when he goes to road course, he's turning right and left from you know, his other accident, so. Yeah, it's, it's, uh, it's a physical job, and your body's gonna take hits. Uh, it is what it is. I don't know how to get away from it. It is what it is. I know I've asked you this before, but um, Brad and RFK, his influence over there. I mean, you didn't have Chris Buescher winning three times this year, did you? Um, no, but I know Brad really well. Um, he's a grinder, and uh, you know he figures things out, and he's smart. I mean, Brad's a smart guy. Um, you know, and they were able to seems like make the right changes over there to make their stuff faster over and over again. And and he's obviously a great speedway racer. I think he's talked he's talk Chris everything he knows is pretty apparent. <laughs> and uh, they got the best handling cars on the on the super speedways right now. So how difficult that's is why it? they win. How difficult is it to say that committed to a teammate like Brad was and Chris? How hard is it? Yeah. Well, when it's your boss, it's probably a lot easier. <laughs> right. Well, if that was you pushing one of your teammates, how? Different, but I mean, I like to think it's the same. I like to think it is. We weren't in that position. We've been in that position before, and it was like that. So.